course Lemmy is sitting waiting for me to start cooking. Because barbecue got the puppy. Hi. Hi, how are you doing? It's going to be so hot today. L.A., 104 yesterday. <laughs> it was brutal. Got the day off. I'm making carnitas tacos with my friend, my brother Scoggins, taco seasoning from Texas. Got my coffee machine. I just had a nice cup of coffee. It was so good. I don't know what that is. I think it's butter. Laura made the croissant. Chocolate croissant. Look at that. Chocolate croissant. That's a pastry with chocolate. Mwah! It's so good. Look what else Laura found. Our favorite mac and cheese. 18 boxes for $9 at Costco. 50 cents a piece. This will last the rest of the year and maybe into next year. <laughs> 50 cents. I remember in the 70s it was 27 cents, 35 cents. So 50, this is like going back 30 years in time. What a deal. I made pork carnitas. Pork tenderloin, pork. I got all the fat out of it. I put it in the pan here. I'm gonna simmer it down, get it all, I'm gonna chop it all up, and simmer, 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 break it down, and I'm gonna make burritos with onion cilantro. Look what I did yesterday, I, for work, I made everything with my pan here. My little lodge, lodge. Made in Missouri, lodge, cast iron, pan. Beef, bean, and cheese. Burritos. I had eight of them in there. I think Laura took one for work. So I have another one to replace it right there. Yeah, eight beef, bean, and cheese burritos for work tomorrow and the rest of the week. I'll give a couple to my friends. And this is what I used. Taco seasoning from my brother Scoggin in Tornado Alley, Texas. I'm going to use this on my burritos. Beef, bean, and cheese. I'm going to use this on my pork carnitas. I'm going to heat this up. I'm going to add this in. Get it all hot. I'm going to chop it all up. Little tiny pieces. I'm going to get all that in there. Then I'm going to get some flour tortillas, onion cilantro, and make another eight burritos. So I'll have eight beef, bean, and cheese. And then eight carnitas. 
burritos, but with no cheese, only onion and cilantro. You don't really put cheese in a pork burrito. It just wouldn't be right. I'm going to uh, give you guys a taste test of this uh, pork. <laughs> I cooked this in the pressure cooker yesterday. It's delicious. All right, let me get the the wide angle shot. Right, let me. Okay, the wide angle shot for the taste test of my pork carnitas. Pretty good. Tender. Onion, cilantro, tortilla. Oh, it's going to be good. It's going to be so good. Oh, my gosh. All right, this is Mick Cotton's Barbecue. I'm going to show you what uh, Skagit sent me. Wolf brand chili. And Texas corn chips. These. These are so good. I can't, you can't even imagine how good those are. Those are the best. I like the plain, we like the plain ones, the plain salted. I got the uh, chocolate croissant. I got taco seasoning. I got the carnitas. I got the macaroni and cheese. And then I got my pan. I'm going to cook everything in my pan here. I'm going to put that in there. Then I got my beef and bean and cheese burritos. And I got Udwais. Ud. Udwais. That's it. Sunday afternoon, Sunday morning, it's 1045. It's already 100, 100 degrees. Praying for all the people in New Orleans with that Ida, the hurricane. It's just awful. Devastating again. New Orleans. Peace, love, and aloha. Bon appetit. Mick, Mick Cotton's Barbecue. I want to shout out to Mickey Lonnie. Mickey Lonnie. Uh, Mega Fred Zeppelin. Rock and roll. Skoget Maple Cook, my brother. Skoget, my brother. Russ Jones, Harry, Harry Wu. Um, Greg Marvich from Ballistic Burgers, Ballistic Barbecue. Um, that's it. I'm going to make a carnitas. Authentic Mexicana. Aloha.